doctor's being transferred to Memphis. Transferred? Did you have a trainee make some sort of phony offer to Lecter in the senator's name? Yeah, I rolled the dice I had to. Well, she's mad as hell, Jack. Paul Krendler's over here from Justice. She's asking him to take over in Memphis. <laughs> Senator Martin, Dr. Hannibal Lecter. Dr. Lecter, I brought an affidavit guaranteeing your new rights. You want to read it before I sign. I won't waste your time or Catherine's time bargaining for petty privileges. Clarice Starling and that awful Jack Crawford have wasted far too much time already. I only pray they haven't doomed the poor girl. Let me help you now, and I will trust you when it is all over. You have my word, Paul. Buffalo Bill's real name is Louis Friend. I met him just once. He was referred to me in April or May 1980 by my patient, Benjamin Raspell. They were lovers, you see. But Raspell had become very frightened. Apparently, Lewis had murdered a transient and done things with the skin. We need his address and a physical description. Tell me, Senator, did you nurse Catherine yourself? What? Did you breastfeed her? Now, wait a minute. Yes, I did. Toughened your nipples, didn't it? Oh, son of a bitch! Amputate a man's leg, and he can still feel it tickling. Tell me, Mom, when your little girl is on the slab, where will it tickle you? Take this thing back to Baltimore. Five for ten, strongly built, about 180 pounds. Hair blonde, eyes pale blue. He'd be about 35 now. He said he lived in Philadelphia, but may have lied. That's all I can remember, Mom. But if I think of any more, I will let you know. Oh, and Senator, just one more thing. Love your suit. 